Sacrifice has led me to this moment. To face him once again. You are not coming with us. The hunter is nothing without the hunt. Did you not see this fate, Prophet? Fate? Our survival was never in fate's hands. Light be with you, Illidan Stormrage. Your crusade is over! What's up everybody, summons to Orgrimmar, so this is the Horde version of the post and Taurus raid questline into Silithus, the pre-questline into Battle for Azeroth-ish, ish, because this is, has nothing to do with Battle for Azeroth, but it is a pre-questline into it, because it is the post-questline to Antorus the raid, so if you've completed Antorus, whether you're Horde, whether you're Alliance, you will be given a quest. Summon to Stormwind, summon to Orgrimmar. Um, they're both going to be different quest lines, but they're both going to be doing the same thing. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get to this. So, we're going to go ahead and visit this dude, turn into quests, and then speak with uh, Nathanos Bray. Okay, so you just got to speak to the guy. If I may offer a few words. It is with both pain and pride that we gather here today. Pain for many brave heroes of the Horde fell against a terrible foe. And pride for against all odds. Sylvanas is bay. Vanquished the Legion. We bled, now we heal. We mourned, now we celebrate for the Horde! For the Horde! This stupid goblin. War Chief, a moment of your time. <sighs> no doubt 
Gallywix wants to push his latest money-grubbing scheme. Rats scurry about their business. And get eaten if they're not careful. <laughs> Keep sending more goblins to Silithus. <laughs> Nothing good has ever come out of Silithus. This will change everything. <laughs> I told you! And the Alliance knows nothing of this. Don't worry, War Chief. I got people on it. <laughs> oh my gosh. That... The, the weapon is legit in Silithus? Are you serious? Like many right. of you. At that alliance I know starting. firsthand Ooh. the pain of loss. My father, King Varian Rin, gave his life to save his people. It took some hours, boys. He knew that no one, not even a king, is more it took important some hours, than the alliance. <laughs> and because he and so many others had the courage to make that sacrifice. We did the impossible. We defeated the Burning Legion. Who's this creeping in? Spymaster Shaw. Back so soon? But by living, our lives, our joy. I need to speak with him. These are the gifts of the Fallen. Now. And we must Alliance, challenge. Alliance, man. You guys get such a different story and celebrate. this. For the Alliance! We've observed an unusually large cluster of goblins at Silithus, and the numbers are increasing. Goblins aren't the most charming people, but they do things for a reason. And those reasons usually involve money. So... These guys are looking all swag. just found something yeah. valuable, then. They have indeed. This. All they get though. My boy Gally with comes in with the freaking scepter what? of the whole freaking thing. Or it is on this? Alliance is failing. We don't know. It would seem the horde does. And we must find out more. Agreed. We have eyes on it. And then they get the same exact thing with the goblin. Uh, so speak to someone in Silithus. operations underway in Silithus. Oh my gosh. Get there at once. And if you see any alliance skulking about, make quick work of them. That's a bad boy. So, uh, we gotta go to Silithus, and I believe the quickest way there is probably Portal to Uldum. Yeah, this is basically, uh, what is it called? Azerite or whatever? Yeah, it's the Azerite stuff for a battle for Azeroth. So this is like that pre-quest line, so... Let's go ahead and get into the quest line. Alright, so we've made our way to Southwind in Silithus. We're about to go ahead and get into this. As you guys can see, the Silithus map has changed. If you're interested in going to the back in time of Silithus, go ahead and go to the lady that's up here at Valor's Rest. But without further ado, turn into quest and uh, motivate 10 lazy prospectors. So let's go ahead and get up there and motivate these prospectors. Um, anyone tuning in to Twilight Geoloids, um, oh wait, nope, no spies allowed, there's another quest over here, my bad. Go ahead and pick it up. 
Uh, book drops off of a rare mob, so I, I'll definitely read it once I can. Um, where is this quest guy at? There he is. What's the word on the street? Alright, so let's get to it. Get into some killing. Gotta kill 10 alliance members and motivate 10 horde members. This shouldn't be too difficult. It was lame, but finally, for whatever reason, but it's like, okay, the Alliance always gets the lame stuff, though. Like, the, the stupid, funny, lame stuff. Like, Horde doesn't get that. Horde is more serious. We're serial about our, our actions. Pop some cools. Get these things down quick. We're 8 and 8 right now, so so far this is working nice and cheap. Probably one here, yep. And one here, we're done with this quest. We've got two more alliance SIs to find. They're usually close by to the worker. Yeah, they're usually close by to the workers, like standing off just a little bit to the side. Well, that one died quick. Alright. Yeah, yeah. Let's turn that one in. And this one. What do you need? So far all I'm getting is gold, so not not the coolest thing. Um there's a quest over here now to pick up. Oh no, I'm turning this one. What's up? But now I'm picking up quest. Ugh. Ugh. Keep it real. Making me do work for you. Alliance is the exact same except the start, uh, we're sabotaging instead. I had to kill goblins and heal Alliance folks. Alright, so it's been the same thing pretty much. Except basically the opening cinematic. That's good though, at least it's not too much of a difference. I just wasn't looking at the star on my mini map. I wonder if I can handle this thing. Let's put, uh, you can have taunt pet. Oh, it looks like you can solo these guys. Uh, when you can, check Orkmar for the new Embassy too. I think it's for the Golden Dragon Scum. I will definitely check it out after you complete this one. What is the Embassy for? Ooh. They're just a horde racial embassy area, basically where the leaders are gathered in our pack. Alright, so we're done with that. Then we got some head. Gotta go get some head. Make sure to pick up the quest. Bit of cloth and it'll. Wait, what? Find us a wee bit of cloth and I'll be good to go. Um, pull everything. What is this guy talking about? Is this... Oh, that's an outhouse. Oh my gosh, we're getting toilet paper for the dude. So yeah, the Alliance and the Horde have the exact same class. Oh man, you gotta get a lot. Of oh, this is a rare spawn. Oh my gosh, yeah, he's gotten another rare spawn, but I haven't looked. I wasn't looking at my mini map. At least these things are soloable, and they really don't do any damage at all. Ooh, I got a book. 200 gold. Read a book. Is the guy that I need to kill in here? Yeah. Kill him. I need to get this guy's head now. Camera angle is terrible right now, boys. I 
again. I can't believe these guys are making me get caught. Uh, the book tells you what the goblins are mining. Oh, I already know what they're mining, but yeah, I got you. Battle for Azeroth stuff. And it's going to be a huge item in the expansion Battle for Azeroth. Give me my, my last cough. Thank you. Let's go turn in all these quests. Alright. Ah, this soak feels better than rain on a summer morning. Now I'll just light a wee match and take care of the fumes. Fire. Stupid dwarf. <laughs> this is the uh this is the alliance quest that you guys were talking about. Uh I guess Horde get to do it as well. Mm, dumb dwarfs. <laughs> That was a close one. I'd better take inventory, eyebrows check, beard check, pants. Oh no. Pants. He forgot his pants. He forgot his pants, boys! This guy's walking like glory, fam. That guy's loving life. That guy is loving life. Alright, let's go turn in those other two quests. This NPC seems to want to be first. Oh, what's shaking? Shit, you already know. Alright, let's go do this one. No time. Ogar. Alright, and then speak with Archmage. We're moving on to this one. Why is Cadgar here too? And deliver to Magni. It seems our victory in Argus was up. Alright. My boy Magni. It is good to see a familiar face in these dark times. It damn is, bro. Since returning from Argus, the cries of Azeroth have been overwhelming. Such pain. I don't know a how to fix this. Thing. Not sure anyone does, but we've got to keep trying. The storm's gathering, hero. If we don't find a way to heal Azeroth, nothing else is gonna matter. Damn straight. Damn straight. Alright, so deliver Magni Brown food message. Are you serious? That's all I had to do. Just go to Magni just for that. Alright, delivering Magni's message. The situation still is now under our control. I will see the rest of the operations go with honor for the one attach you. Yeah? That's it? That's it, boys? Well then. That is the uh the little first quest line, fam. And I will catch you around when there is more. Peace. Alrighty, everybody. So, we're going to be reading Ogmar's Dream Journal, which came from one of the rare spawns that we killed during the Silithus Adventures. Uh, basically explains on what's going on here. Might look stupid in my camera. In fact, you might not even see me in my camera because of how freaking close I have to get to my screen to read this. But, uh, let's get to it. Ogmat was just a puny boy fighting at the war camp when the masters first blessed me with the vision. I come to Silithus, to the great wound seeking wonders. Make Ogmat your vessel, masters. Last night, Ogmat, dreams of great battle. Two fleets bashing on ocean of blood. Shadows twisting beneath, the ships rising. Raising Ogmat so happy watching the carnage. Then Ogmat gets waked by the citrine sounds, stupid bugs. Don't matter. Ogmat knows these dreams soon come true. Life comes back to this wasted land. First the bugs come. Now the gobbies skulking round. They crave in the world blood. Ogmat, I'm sure of it. Bah! Let them have these dripping. Soon, Ogmar, gonna drink rivers of blood. The master's promise. Today, smoke rises up from the campfire. Smoke tells Ogmar, good story. Ogmar sees lady wrapped in dark swirlies. Swirlies. <laughs> she leads her the blind sheep. The sheepies. Sheepies. 
Follow her ever place. She go. Do everything she say. Never doubt lady. She guide them all over the cliff. Splat, splat, splat. Stupid sheepies. The crows get fat eating the sheep flesh. The lady laugh at crows eat. Ogmont laugh too. Ha ha. That blade has shiny eye. Always watching us. Why you no see it? Three lies. The first one, been told. Bound by that throne? No, free free. The next, gonna come soon. Maybe they this one. Other hammers here now. They talk, and talk about August. About the one that got wakened. About great victory that our enemy not even noticed. But only Ogmat sees the vision. Other hammers not blessed by the masters. Ogmat shares his dreams with the others. But the skinny one just laughed. Ogmat no like her. Many days pass with no visions. Did Ogmat make the masters angry? Did Ogmat sacrifice? Please, the masters. Remember, Ogmat. The stat. Watching Ogmat, too shiny. Ogmat gonna hide from it. The dagger spoke too. It been too long since Ogmat got down. Masters, no forsake Ogmat. The bones got picked clean, but Ogmat still get no visions. The others laugh. They Ogmat, not devoted. But me is the chosen one. Ogmat, no lose faith. Another sacrifice? Yes, one more of them ain't gonna be missed. Roused by her screams, stirred by the whispers, a blessing comes from the masters. Now Ogmat understand, a door, a path, ours, ours. Ooh, the circle awakened us all. God damn straight it did, Ogmat. How many times did I have to say Ogmat in that thing? Uh, um, let's have fun. Yay, we're gonna have fun, boys. Dark swirlies. Sheepies. Weapons with eyes. I, I don't think I'm gonna survive. You guys think it's gonna take me two minutes to get down? I don't think. I think it's gonna take me like five years to get down with a glide guider. We gliding, boys. This is just gliding. They hate him, but we have taken an L, and we are not going to bounce back. Next time, in for the one Itachi, does he live from the fall? Who the hell knows, because probably doesn't. This was a peaceful glide, not going to lie, this was pretty peaceful. Look how freaking soft he lands into that. That was peaceful.